What's up guys? Um, I'm here to show you how to import a song from iTunes into GarageBand. Um, if it shows um, that you can't import it. Uh, so I'll show you here. Uh, if I try and add an audio file, I may not, may or may not um, do a video of this later on, but uh, if I try to add, don't follow Alice in Chains. It, it's in like gray lettering, so I can't import it into GarageBand, so you have to uh, purchase it, actually, and I'll show you how to do that here. So um, if I go to iTunes, pull up iTunes, uh, Don't Follow is already uh, downloaded for my Apple Music. Um, so if you go into, uh, click on these three dots here and scroll down, uh, you can do show an iTunes store and because I already have it downloaded, uh, it'll just show play. So I have to go back, um, and then I have to click on the three dots again, remove download, and then click on the three dots, scroll down, show an iTunes store, and then, um, 129. All right, so once you have that purchased, um, then just go back into GarageBand, click add audio file, and then you should be able to scroll down music, uh, look up don't follow. And there you go. You're able to import it into GarageBand. I hope this video helped you. Um, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks.